and welcome back, my strategists, to the Battle of Runan. So, the carrying on, this will be chapter 2 for Cao Cao. Well, I mean, we're getting a recap, Liu right? Bei so, we know what's going on. To escape to the south. However, Cao Cao has no time to launch a counterattack on Liu Bei. For the hero of He Bi, Yuan Shao, is now in position to attack Zhu Cheng. Cao Cao's army returns to Zhu Cheng and prepares for the confrontation with Yuan Shao. But what's that? We didn't fight Yuan Shao in Runan. Let us begin. Outline your ideas for conquering the land. A lot of the farmland in this territory has been turned into wasteland from lack of cultivation during the war. Let's increase the harvest yields by rounding up refugees to work the land. I have an idea. You know, I've never really noticed this before, but I like how Liu Bei's one's like, we'll work the land, and she's like, oh, let's get refugees to do it. only fighting Cao Cao so he can die with honor. The soldiers who hear it will get so scared that they will run away. <laughs> this is the way I see it. It's very clear. Our army still has many areas that need much improvement. I suggest you assign me to troop training duty. Sire, what do you wish us to do? Well, you know what? Our supplies actually are our highest thing, so I don't think we really need more farm stuff. Um, you're just weird. Um, so let's train the troops. All right, do it. But I am warning you all: do not fail. Yes, yes sir. sir. Due to my training, these men will become much stronger. Why is Jia Yuan's magic ability increasing? Who needs that? You're bad at your job, Cao Ren. Cao Cao and his army reach a standoff in the fight against Yuan Shao in Guangdu. In the meantime, Liu Bei rallies his forces and advances toward the weakened capital of Zhu Chang. Oh, uh, pesky Liu Bei. Cao Cao does not have the faintest idea of what's going on. You could always explain to him. Perhaps it would be a good okay. idea to tell him. Yes, I will. But where should I begin and how much should I say? He probably wouldn't believe me even if I did. Liu <laughs> Bei's approaching the capital? Why didn't I already know this? It was supposed to be watched! Please forgive me. <laughs> My lord. Should we go fight Liu Bei while we're in the middle of battling Yuan Shao? My lord, please leave it to me. You don't know about fighting. Go away now. <laughs> uh, get away lord, from me. Please allow me. Cao Ren, your defense is strong, but you can't handle sudden changes. Enough said. Please, my lord, let me go. I'll kill Liu Bei and rid you of the thorn in your side. Hmm. I will not fail you, my lord. Well, after Zun Yu attacks, I will devise a plan to take down Liu Bei. Yes, my lord. Prepare the troops. What do we do about the battle with Yuan Shao? Yeah, how you want. It's up to you. I'm going to take care of Liu Bei. Yuan Shao is not important. Let's just ignore him. Report on your situation. According to the scouting unit's report, the enemy is currently occupying this position. In this battle, sire, I fear our only chances of winning is by forcing Liu Bei's unit to flee. If my lord has to flee, we will surely lose. State your strategies. Sire, if you would, consider this idea. Since it looks as if the enemy is going to attack in two groups, we should divide our army in two. The units of Hu Ji and Cao Ren will strike Wan Yu and Zheng Fei, respectively. I will destroy this bridge so that Liu Bei and his troops will not be able to cross. Then the whole army will crush Guan Yu and Zheng Fei and immediately destroy the enemy storehouse. As soon as Liu Bei turns back, he will be destroyed. Hmm. 
My lord, I too have a splendid idea that does not have any voice clips. At the most opportune time, order Eugene to put sleeping potions in the drinking water of Guan Yu and Zheng Fei's units. <laughs> Those brave little warriors who could take on thousands single-handedly will be fast asleep and unable to fight. Oh, whilst they sleep, we can just flatten Liu Bei with our whole army and create their worst nightmare. My lord, which strategy will you have us employ? I didn't listen to you last time and I got a little bit hectic, so I'm going to go with destroy the bridge. Um, and we'll focus on strategy. taking on the enemy in the mountains rather than splitting them up. Because obviously I can put them to sleep, but they might wake up at some point and then I'm going to have to split off. And also I don't take them down, so I don't get the experience from that. And I would like to get experience. I would like my units to level up, thank you very much. Okay, so who have I got then? Who are my units? We've got Kao Kao here. It's got Kao Bu, Gojia and Himiko. Okay. Who's Shin Yu got? Shin Yu, Yui Jin, Lidian. Okay, they're going for the bridge. Kao Ren, Shi Jun Feng, Jun Feng, Yui Jin. Huji's got just Chen Yu. Okay. So this will be a little tough about Ji Hao Yuan, I'm sure. But we'll manage. I mean, I feel like it would be more sense for her to like put mines on the bridge and then activate it when someone was crossing. But you know, you do what you're doing, girl. Yeah, well, she's already blown the bridge, so. Can I see them at all? No. I don't like that I can't see them. There we go, I see them, I see them. Control stick's not working, that's why. Oh, well, I can use the D pad, so that's fine. Attack! 
Okay, so I can still get around like that. That's something, I suppose. see more enemies in the horizon there. Oh, their formation just apparently has Shang Yu charging. Okay. Now the question is, can the EA be able to get on there? Although we can only go two at a time as well, so that's not the best. No, oh, was that nice? In the name of my father, we'll win the war. I need to do much because the bridge is gone, so. Ah, so many fine and brave men. Oh, just look at the sight. All here to march in glory with the great Lord Liu Bei. The Han Empire will triumph. He'd be no, I'm not to be able to get through, so does he have any archers? No. Oh well, apparently, um, Shang Kui can't get through either. So many rallies. Oh, that's right, I can't turn. Of... I can go forward, that's working fine. Weird. Damn cheap controllers. Well, deep it is.
Yeah. It's too much here. We must be reinforced. On you. I can help you out now. Oh, uh, totally. Gain my sacred honor for good. And the people. Um, but it's not. Really, he's already there. He's not doing much. Stay dead. I mean, it says I've got so many iron walls, but some other abilities would also be nice. I thought that was his like rally getting ready to come back. I shouldn't use Gun Archer, so maybe I can get her into position to like shoot with arrows as well. Appearing. Have you learned? Not yet, then. I see. What's going on there? But I never lose. No! How dare you do that? Did they like go all the way up to where the bridge was and then come down? Wow, amazing. No, not with both of them, surely. Ready. Yeah, ooh. Jeez. Now they'll clamber into each other, only one should be able to get through. Now let's retreat again.
Now, part of also gonna like, well, I mean, destroying the bridge was one thing, um, but I feel like I'm sort of locked in these mountains now. Hopefully. This should be the right angle that I can assist with arrows. I never quite really understood how... Oh, my bag on the right stick's not working either. Ugh. How this mechanic really works, but in theory, if I am close enough, at the right angle, we should shoot with arrows. If not, what I might try and do is have Cal Ren move forward. Ah, oh, well, it doesn't really matter too much. It's almost done. Anyway, I'm also just going to have Cal Ren like, go back across the bridge because there's not much I can really do here right now. So you can just wait there. In case we need to retreat, um, less people here clogging up. At least um, Cal Ren and Huji are going to get a lot of experience from this. Well, I can't say too much for Cal Cal Ren and you, but... Oh, nope. Don't you move. You have a turn. I'm missing I might be able to fit in there. Eh, yeah, probably not. Are you oh, okay, yep, see like we didn't shoot my battles, uh I 
and he's just confused now, so. These are meant to be yellow, very pale yellow. I would like, I don't know, try and do more in these butts, but one, I'm still not fully sure what they do really do, and two, it's a lot harder without the proper control stick, because my control stick side is a lot wonky. Come back. I want to stab you. Yeah. Well, I feel fulfilled. I'm like, no, stay down. Bad. Okay, who are we against next? Whoa. Okay, you apparently. I mean, I probably should have used Dong Zhong Pings first. But, well, there's Lulu. Lulu. Okay, I've got to see if I can try and get like right into the side before like battle started, but okay. Okay, 
Apparently this is also just close enough for archers, so who knows how close it actually is close enough. But we are at that close enough stage, I guess. Oh, Chengyu has learned a new spell. Hell, but Mr. Yang also has an iron wall, so that's not going to go anywhere. Wrong cow. I meant to go to you. There's a bit more space I might have been able to like slip through and get to their supply depot. Might still be able to do that if I put my cart straight. No spin slashes for you, rude. Oh, I'm gonna go stab that person, but they're dead, so. Oh, Huji, no! I think Huji should pull that after this. Huge. I'll try to wait for Huji's one to come back because it wouldn't be blocked, but uh, she's getting paid close to going down, so. Okay, 
Tuo sun ovi. I think Xiao Kang can reach Kaorin. Ah, look! They're beaten! Victory is ours! Done. We're defeated! We must retreat! I would like to take him down, Joe. Maybe I still can. Maybe if I play this right. Oh, that did a lot of damage. This is like no damage, but let's confuse these ones, so that's something I suppose.
Yeah, just like you think you have to really use that one, so. If I hadn't used the rush, I may have tried Shou Kang first. Go easy peasy. The enemy general has been defeated. We've won. Taste the strength of my army. Victory. Lord, Cao Hong has returned from conquering Zhu. Oh, hello. What is the outcome? The citizens of Zhu have submitted. No one wants the Han Empire to be restored. Mm, I see him. Hmm. Next, let's take down Liu Bei! Don't underestimate him. Don't stop until you take him down and kill him. Okay, crazy eyes. I'm here to report that our army is strong and our country prospers from the spoils of war. Yay, spoils! I mean, at least Kakao Jr. got some experience from surviving. Um, pity I couldn't really use him, but. The mountains were like just not not really a lot of space to maneuver in there, which really played to my advantage. Um, I could have went with the sleep one and went the other side. The problem is, as you may have noticed, Liu Bei's side that came across the bridges that attacked had Liu Bei, Zhao Yun, Mei Sang Yang, which would have been four to three. But then Zhao Kang comes as reinforcements, so it's four to four. So it's not great. Um, here it was easier to take some of them down because I was ganging up on them two and one. I guess some of them with some of the abilities like Rush, I probably would be able to take them down and bring the other ones, but mm, you'd be pushing it. Plus, I can't remember, uh, I don't, I doubt, I can't remember, but I doubt Guan Yu and Zhang Fei stay asleep the whole time. At which point, if you're busy dealing with those four down there, Guan Yu's got a direct line straight to your supply depot. So I think just um, turtling them into the the mountains and then just picking them off one at a time is probably the best strategy for that one. Um, so we'll come back uh, next time with the next level and we'll see how that one goes. Till then always remember, those who fail to plan, plan to fail. See ya!